Welcome everybody to Platform 32. I hope you can hear me. Uh, I'm trying out OBS Streamlabs. I figured, oh, why not? Considering I'm doing my first stream in three weeks, why not make it even more complicated by trying out some kind of new streaming setup? Hold on a second, let's see if we can hear me. There we go. Yeah, I can hear me. We're good. We're good. Welcome one and welcome all. It is I, Ian Higton, and I'm back from my uh, my delayed honeymoon. I went to Japan for three weeks, went from Tokyo to uh, Kyoto to Hiroshima to Nagasaki, then flew to Okinawa, and then from Okinawa back to Tokyo, and then back home and this is my first day back at work for Eurogamer and streaming for you guys here on Platform 32. Um, I'm going to be doing uh, a game called Close to the Sun today. It's a little bit more chilled than I normally do but it's like a narrative story driven horror game. Uh, I played quite a bit of it at Gamescom a couple of years ago but um i've i'm a bit jet laggy at the moment so i thought something where i can just kind of be quiet every so often and listen to the the uh the game story unfolding will help me ease myself in gently oh uh, that's what she said tee uh so welcome to everyone who's joining me we've got 69 people nice in the comments already so let's get uh close to the sun up oh we got loot message i forgot all about loot um, I've also, uh, I'll read this Luke's message, then I'll load up loot. Um, I've also done a thing with, um, welcome back, Squeon. I can't see you wrote that. I think it was Kate Lily. Uh, I've also, like, I'm trying out Streamlabs OBS. So if someone subscribes or does a super chat or something, it may go up on screen. I'm not sure. Uh, if you're watching and you haven't subscribed yet and you want to help me test, uh, maybe do a do a subscribe uh, and see. Because I think it'll put up notifications. Uh, if something happens like someone uh, has been a member for like a certain amount of time or it becomes a member or stuff. That's what I've set it up to do, whether or not I set it up properly is another thing right where the hell is the game here's the game there's close to the sun okay space i've got to do the super chat one pound will it come up on here uh on on the stream thing who knows uh let's have a little look and see on the notifications thing oh something happened then there we go. Space I've got to donated one pound through Super Chat. Hey, I don't know how to change the zombie or the text or anything yet, but uh, I am learning. I am learning. So there we go. And that happens if you subscribe, and if you like, if you've been, a, if you become a member. I think it does member anniversaries as well. So um, look, let's check this out because a couple of people, Fruit Bat and. Um, uh epileptic fridge boy uh vandal they've been members for 12 months in a row i think if i press that it might come up on screen that vandal has been a member for 12 months in a row uh van oh it says vandal has become a member oh. well vandal's been a member for 12 months in a row allegedly so vandal should have a blue box next to their name uh, like Fruit Bat does and Castaway DC does. Frederick Johansson donated. Uh, he did a super chat. Hey, he makes a noise that I can hear through my headphones. So, like, I actually hear these things coming in now, so I can look rather than missing them, like I do loot messages all the time. Anyway, let's get my loots up. A actually, I'll, I'll, t I'll start close to the sun up, and then I'll do. My I'll sort out my loot because there's like a. A prologue and all kind of stuff to do so we're gonna go here and we're gonna go are you sure and i'm gonna do okay, yes hopefully the game audio is not too loud it looks like it might be quite loud though so do let me know in the chats in a second oh we can also hear that noise says uh fruit bat oh okay yikes do those noises happen on uh, on Twitch as well? 
Right enough. Okay, yes, this is very Bioshocky, this game, which is one of the things that uh, uh, really. Um, got my attention with it. Let's take the sound of that game down and hopefully haven't missed too much. The brilliance of Ada. The bleeps are on Twitch too. Oh, maybe I, I'll see if I'll, I'll see if I can turn the bleeps off at some point. But let's get this going first. My dear sister, I left you suddenly and without warning. For that and so much more to come, I apologize. I didn't board the Helios knowing what would happen. Only that pursuing my research could change the world, and we did. Just not in the way I'd imagined. Not yet, anyway. I want to explain everything now, so that you'd see that there is nothing to fear. You've always tried to protect me, my big sister, but this was meant to be. It's now my turn to protect you, if only so that things unfold the way they are meant to. Time and necessity has kept us apart, but that is about to change. We need you here aboard the Helios with me. Yes. I've enclosed a receiver, and as the name implies, it can receive signals through which we will communicate. I know a little of this will make any sense right now, but I also know that you will keep your promise. I love you. Your sister, Ada. Pretty light on details there, Ada. You leave without warning and now need me aboard the Helios? What are you telling me? Let's just go options quickly. Audio. Voices volume is 10. Let's bring the effects and that down. The effects and the music. Let's bring the music down a bit more. And let's go back. Uh, Mossy, I did eat um, potato flavoured Kit Kats. Well, sweet, purple sweet potato um, flavoured Kit Kats I ate while I was out there. All right, here we go. Uh, da, 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 da. I've done the audios, Streamlabs is a big Twitch thing before they added YouTube integration, so, oh, okay. So they've just added YouTube integration, I guess. Alright, let's carry, crack on with the game. I think everything's sorted, but do let me know if there is anything wrong with the audio and things. So yeah, Closest Sun, uh, my uh, sister Ada has sent me an invitation to join her on a big old ship called the Helios, which was made by Tesla. Uh, oh, here's the, how do I do this? Examine Helios. Oh, there we go. Frederick Johansson, thank you. He says, sup, sup chat. Uh, the Helios, eighth wonder of the world. A triumph of engineering for the advancements of science. So yeah, big old uh, Tesla invented ship. And we are on our way. To get aboard it, there's a picture of the Helios. Build a future. Ooh. There it is. Docking. Yeah, me too, right. So enter the observation cam. Cabin and commence stocking. Let's make our way inside. So it's a pretty, uh, pretty lonely little ship at the moment. Can I examine it any other way? So it just reads the text. Okay. Welcome back, Platform 32. Hope you had a lovely break. This is Hockey Rough on Leeds. I did. I had a, I, I had a very good time. Uh, it's very tiring, though. I came back knackered because we were doing so much, so much travelling. Most people on their honeymoons, they go to like, you know, all-inclusive, sunny beaches where they just sit down and drink booze all the time. But me and Laura, we uh, we went proper backpacking around Japan, and uh, yeah. Whoa. Oh, sleepy. Lots of jet lag and things. Mary Sims is a new subscriber. She says, best of luck. Thank you, Mary Sims. 
I love a bit of soaking wet docking, says Gavin UK. Who doesn't? Who doesn't? I do as well, which is why I'm going to press the button to commence docking procedure. There's Miss Mary Sims' notification popped up. That's very big. I may reduce the size of those. They do come up very big, don't they? Best of luck, new subscriber. Okay. Me and my wife will do the Japan Adventure when we hit 50, says Frederick Ree Hansen. I would, if w one thing I would recommend is uh, learning the basics of Japanese. Like, hello, goodbye, please, thank you, excuse me, stuff like that. It's, uh, it's very helpful. Wow. Loving the new blue boxes, the blue... The, the sapphire loot crates surrounded with gold there for the 12 month subscribers. Angel Beats got one as well. Very pretty, very pretty. Ian, I'll have to start saving my gifts and send them to you so you can use them for alerts, says Gavin. Oh, yeah, go on then. That'd be cool. So here we go. We are, we are docking our way towards the Helios. Oh! front has opened up and it contains the sun excuse me is a really important one says Isabel CW on Sumimasen sure is Mary Sims donated a pound to Super Chat a euro even thank you Mary Sims I have no idea how to add uh, gifts of my face and stuff to this thing but we'll find out uh Let's bring that down a bit. Make that a bit smaller. Boop. There we go. Ada Archer, younger sister to Rose. Oh, I missed that. I'm Rose. Sister's Ada. We're on the border of Hermes. In. The Helios. That weird crackly audio when... Uh, when we're just on a static title screen. How bizarre, how bizarre. Do -do 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 -do. All right, here we go. Mary Sims, you crazy. Right, uh, here we go. We are out and about. We are inside now, the Helios. It might not look like it because it's so foggy and murky in here. But we are in the depths of a gigantic Tesla ship. The great Helios would be more busy. I guess Ada didn't tell anyone I was coming. Yeah, what could possibly be going on here in this kind of steampunky, um, art deco inspired world? Could it be some kind of horror? Quite possibly. Was that a whale? Definitely a bit quiet here. The Helios, a scientific endeavor that cruises in luxury while the rest of the world is left to fend for itself. Yes. Uh, Rich has been using this stuff too. He was the one that told me about it, Castaway DC. I had no idea it even existed. Uh, oh, sniper Elite loots. Did you go off to any of the cat islands in Japan, says Fruit Bat? No, we didn't. We went to uh, went to two islands. Went to Bunny Seems Island, like to in. which is um, like quite dark, really, but cute. Dark but cute. It was uh, an island where uh, the Japanese army developed and tested um, like mustard gas and gas bombs and things like that and they tested them on rabbits and stuff and when the Americans liberated it, all the rabbits got free and kept breeding and now there's millions of them on this little island um, alongside a, a, a museum of um, well, mustard a mustard gas museum basically um, so yeah, pretty, uh, pretty crazy lots of World War II style well, lots of old World War II ruins and buildings there to 
like look at and lots of bunnies to feed with food. And the other island we went to was called distributing electricity to half of the world and yet still hungers for that other half. Hunger uh, the other um, island was called Battleship Island or Gunkanjima and it was um, an old mining island which was once the most heavily or densely populated island in the world uh, and then like the mining got cut off and it got completely uh, abandoned and now it's just this island with like these giant multi-story buildings that are just like nothing there it's like kind of like looks a bit like how if you imagine how Chernobyl looks kind of like that ruins and empty buildings smashed glass and things pretty cool um, yeah it's very cool uh, right let's carry on I'll put photos of stuff like that up as days go I'll do like uh, I'll, I'll tweet out pictures of interesting places I went but I wanted because it was uh, oh no this doesn't look good quarantine oh no what have you got yourself into I tried to stay off social media like it for right. a lot of the trip because I was on my honeymoon of course I was on social media a bit especially because we were doing a lot of traveling waiting around in train stations and things like that I would uh, go on Twitter then. Oh. Uh oh. Yeah, I'd go on Twitter then, and uh, I was also I went on Twitter to promote uh, my uh, my uh, Ian's VR Corner episodes. Of course, you may have seen the adventures of Sir Higton over on Eurogamer, youtube.com forward slash Eurogamer. Good channel that. You should subscribe to it. Um, that was uh, that was a uh, a very cool uh, little live stream series I did on platform thirty two, which I repurposed for some Eurogamer videos to cover the Sundays while I was off, because obviously I couldn't review any new um, games because <laughs> I was in Japan and I didn't have my PSVR headset with me. Ah. Door's broken. How do I get through here, I wonder? Oh, that's cool. I like that, how you walk up against that window and then put the hand on it. The VR corner was brilliant, and I hope there's more. This is about CW1. There may be some more. There may be in the future. I mean, I'll, I'll probably go back to reviewing new games and, and previewing new games and stuff now, but... Elevator up ahead. Hmm. But it was fun making Shit. them, and people seem to enjoy Security them as well, which is good. Mm. I did incredibly well, considering. I'll have to disable it. Renowned Russian mathematician Ivan Asanov joins the Warren Cliff Corporation. So they're getting all the smart asses onto this boat, are they? This is very Bioshock, isn't it? That's basically what they did with the Rapture, wasn't it? They uh, got all the smart asses on. Is this a bit dark for you lot? Maybe I should uh, bring the gamma up a bit. It's kind of dark for me, to be honest. Hopefully we'll be able to see a bit more now. Uh, welcome home, good schnaffler. Uh, Angel Beat says on loot. That's about to pop up on screen in a second. Oh, ooh, ooh, okay. Ooh. S. Gamji, private office. Samuel Gamji. Samwise Gamji? No. What was his name? I don't know. Samwise Goofy. This is Nikola Tesla speaking. Oh. Gee, thanks for the warm welcome. Now, okay. what have you done with my sister? Yeah, where's my sister, Tesla, you dick? So, graphics wise, this is a, a really pre beautiful looking game. French climatologist Jean Valpreux seen boarding shuttle vessel to the Helios. 
Um, great detail in the environment. And, um, yeah, I just really love the, uh, the design of the ship's interior and, uh, all the furniture and everything. It's really, um, really well done art-wise. What you see here, what you do here, when you leave here, let it stay here. Oh, okay. So what happens on the Helios stays on the Helios, huh? Hold on a minute. What's all these things? Oh, I did a little guff. What is it? Helios internal test tube. Don't worry, her research holds the key to everything. This is from no one to no one. Who's Who was this message for? Yeah, was it for me or was it for someone else? Show me can't play in VR, says Frederick Johansson. This would be a great game to play in VR. I'd love to play this game in VR. Anything else worthwhile up here to schnurple? Oh, yeah, here we go. Who's this? Loose pages of a newspaper. Tesla's death ray to make war impossible. Nikola Tesla proposes to compel the world towards peace with the threat of immeasurable damage. His newly announced weaponry is about to go up for auction. It has nations all over the world scrambling for funds. Tesla's ship-mounted weaponry could annihilate an entire fleet. Oh, Tesla, you... You little psycho! Down we go. Let's head through this door here. So I need to work out how to unlock the elevator. Locked. Interrogation room. What? Two interrogation rooms? The hell needs two? Oh shit. Okay. I say who the hell it needs two interrogation rooms, but I guess this one was busy. Oh, look at that creepy mask. Right, what can we find in here that's going to help? Sylvia's passport. She was born in England, 1860. Passport number. Length visit seven days. Okay. Ugh. Bugs! There's a bit of... lots of crap on the floor. Oh. Jackpot! Infosec just sent a tube that corroborates the dates and places. He's an Edison spy, all right? Edison's the other... Sci famous scientist, isn't he? Your gut instincts are right. Again, it's important that we make this one count. We need to tap him on all he knows whether he wants to sing or not. This is definitely a West-West situation. Feel free to get creative. Oh, I don't like the sounds of that. And we've got another newspaper here. Nikola Tesla recruits British intelligence officer to oversee information security aboard the Helios. Yet another high-profile scientist joins the ever-growing Helios crew. Sabotage attempt averted as Helios shuttle avoids ramming. I'll never avoid a ramming. Ooh. Would you kindly find... Would you kindly find your sister? Says Gavin UK86. Okay. Right. Have we, have we found everything we need to here? Oh no, look. What's this? A West West. Never eat shredded wheat. West. West. Eh, uh, puzzles. So it's like a narrative horror puzzle game, this. Shit, son. Wait until my editor hears about this. And that's some, uh, that's some pretty dark and used torture equipment. Nothing else to see in here. I love that spinning uh, fan light. Because there's nothing, nothing else to grab in here, huh? That's locked. Ah. Uh. Wait, does that move at all? No. Who's this? Profile Vapor, incoming threat. So I think they thought that guy was a spy, maybe? Security override. That's what I need. Okay. One more to go. So yeah, there's one of the left doors done, so I guess I need to go on the other side now. Continue my 
exploration. S field. Your room's locked. S field. A mirrors. A mirrors' room is locked. So, can we get in here? That's locked. Some kind of crazy map room. That's where we need to get into to unlock the other lift. Hello. Oh. Any, that, anyone there? That, hey, 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 hey! No, boy. The fuck was that? Is that about the way I came? I don't run very fast. I hope nothing's coming to chase me. Oh, it's paint. Paint, not blood. That's good. It's good to know. Good to know. Welcome back, Loot Boop, says Dragon Ball. They're on Loots. Why, thank you. Boop. Rick Sanchez is probably on board here if they're getting all the super smart scientists together, says Gavin UK. New series of that coming out soon. Well, November, I think. If you like Rick and Morty. I like Rick and Morty. I think it's quite funny. Out of order. Use the ladies' room. Keep it clean. Okay. Oh. Well, how, how the hell am I supposed to have a dump now? Don't slam. Don't do a spooky slam. Oh! At Fruitbat donated £5 through Super Chat. Could this one day be a gif of Titchy? Because you know that would make people spam Super Chats. I might try and turn that sound off or down if... Uh, that's true, because uh, I'm not sure if that's off-putting or not. Maybe a little bit quieter would be f would be okay. If I was in the middle of streaming a horror game or something, which I'm doing right now, and a tense bit, and then it went, <laughs> I'd probably shit my pants. That'd probably make people subscribe more, to be fair. So that's good that it works with uh, Super Chats. I haven't seen it, anyone do a subscribe. Oh, yeah, I think I did, actually. Mary did a new subscribe one. Uh, okay. Oh, I need to work out the directions for these things again. Okay, let's go down here. Oh. Uh, in accordance... To procedure protocol 812, officers greeted the shuttle from Sydney upon arrival. When the guest did not appear as instructed, the officers embarked the shuttle to perform a standard search. The guest was not found aboard, and neither was any of it the issued warden cliff paperwork or issued clothing. Further inspection of the vessel revealed a noticeable but harmless indentation on the starboard side of the shuttle. There is no record of this dent when the vessel left Sydney, so it is possible that the shuttle was boarded by another ship while en route to the Helios. This is the eleventh incident of similar nature this year alone. The vulnerable nature of our automatic shuttles has to be corrected. The ID documentation and war and Warden Cliff uniforms that are regularly lost could provide Edison with enough information to create convincing forgeries. I've yet to receive any reassurance that measures are being taken to prevent these incidents from reoccurring. Take security very seriously on this ship, then, then. Edison agents? Mm. Seems like their rivalry is alive and well. Yeah. Agent infiltration success awaiting first report. False flag operations in progress in Cuba. Yeah. There's the boat, whether it's here now or not. Uh, what's this? Oh, keep pressing the wrong button to read. British Navy in pursuit of the Helios. Alleged kidnapping of prominent British mathematician. Mathematician has the world on edge. Hand him over, says the Prime Minister. Wardenclyffe denies wrongdoing. Claims that Maxwell joined voluntarily. International group of diplomats rally to calm rising tensions. Ooh. The PM's getting a bit pissy. What's this? Interrogation subject Andre Lichenko. Function of his messenger to sleeper agent aboard the Helios. Further interrogation required. Still refuses to give up the name of target agent. Oh, so there's lots of lots of different spies at work aboard the uh, the Helios. Spy connections involved people. Tom, Kate, John. What is this? Name Jung Huan Choi. Birthplace Korea. It's a lab researcher. Hmm. 
Nothing else of import here. Okay, let's carry on. Let's carry on. Welcome back in, says Jacob M. on Lutz. Why, thank you. Why, thank you. Oh, shit, son. Oh, dear God. That got me uh, a little bit afeared. All right. So we came through that door, did we? Storage room. Storage room is locked. Need to find some kind of code so I can change the arrows to open that door. M hots. Mmm, M hots. So that's just that's just back out there, isn't it? What am I missing? What did I miss? Something. There's going to be something around here. Maybe with like east or west or something written on it. I hope. Otherwise, I'm stuck already. Yeah. Oh, that's the. That's his passport. It's very good chalkboard writing. You know, you're right, uh, fruit bat. Bishop group. Check records. Hmm. I mean, is it just going to be west west again? No. Oh, the other one was up up, I think. There we go. Yeah. There we go. I was just the other security room had up up as its pass word and it was already open. Oh fuck, I'm gonna keep doing that, aren't I? Uh Ananya Patel, lab technician. Armless, suspected sleeper agent. Okay, so more spies. Let's get this lift done. That should do it. Now to find Ada. Okay, let's go. Ada, I'm coming. Coming for you, sister of mine. Ooh. Examine. A worn key card used for the Helios entrance elevator. Let's do this. Hey! Whoa! What the hell? Hey, motherfucker. Hey! Hey! Who was that angry douche? Uh, new member, Terrible Gamer YL. Thanks for becoming a new member. I don't know if that came up on screen or not. Um, it's supposed to, but I didn't hear a bleep bloopy thing. Let's have a quick look at the notification y type things. Fruit bat donated. No, it hasn't. Oh, yeah, there it is. There it is. It just took a little while to come up. Nice. The Fire of Prometheus, Chapter 2. Thank you very much for becoming a brand new sparkly member, Terrible Gamer YL. I uh, hope you enjoy your uh, your brand new uh, emojis that you can play with. You can play with my face, or you can play with Richard's face, or you can play with Luke's face. I wouldn't recommend playing with Simo's face. <laughs> Actually, you could rub a sausage. You could rub a sausage on Simo's face. And then you could watch Luke pet titch. There we go. If you're watching this in the future and you can't see the chat, I'm spamming out emojis. That's why I was just saying those weird things. I haven't gone insane, honestly. Generic loot's message due to brain failure. At least the zombies won't be after me today, says Hockey Rup. Thanks for the loot's messages. Um, much appreciated. It's very good to be back streaming. I'm... I'm pretty skin tired though, which is why I'm probably a bit quieter and saying fewer words than normal. Uh, but um, hopefully, 
It's a nice short week for me. I've only got to work today, which I've already done, tomorrow and Friday. And then I've got a weekend, which uh, I will be using to do lots of sleeping. So hopefully by Monday I'll be back to my normal self. But should be able to do a drunk PUBG stream on Friday. Um, fingers crossed I'll be all good there. You are here. I'm at the Teslatorium. And there are lots, lots of different rooms on this ship, huh? Crazy. Teslatorium. It's a, it's, a, it's a museum to Tesla. Wow, this game is pretty. You can play it in 4K, this game. But um doesn't really work too Archie. well when I'm streaming as well. So I've, I've knocked it down to 1080. For me. But I bet in 4K this game looks Rose? well Ada. good. Holy shit, Rose! Ada. What the hell are you doing here? Wait, what? Ada, you told me to come. I've got your letter right here. That... That doesn't make any sense. I didn't write you any letter, Rose. Thanks, Nightcap. But, but never mind. There's been an accident. Or sabotage. It, it doesn't matter. We need to get off this ship. That's what the quarantine is about? Ada, what the hell is going on? Rose, listen very carefully. We really need to leave. It's spreading all... Ada! Ada! Uh-oh. Uh -oh. Maybe I can get a better signal <clears throat> So something is spreading, but we don't know what. And uh, it looks like Tesla might be behind it. Whoop, whoop, whoop. Right, what do we got here? Glasses. Can't go behind the desk thanks to these uh, <laughs> magnificently placed chairs. Just got some kind of pipes behind. Uh, left or right? Let's go. Let's go right. What have we got here? Like United States Patent Office electromagnetic motor. Wonder if these are actual patents of his. Titchy. Hello. Titch stayed with my mum for three weeks. She went on holiday as well. She doesn't do catteries, really, Titch. She doesn't get on with them. Doesn't eat or sleep or anything. She just sits there being terrified. So um, my mum kindly offered to look after her, which was very good. It meant we could relax. Hey, so. To expand the limits of human endeavor. Away from prying eyes, cynical money men. Here, all that matters is progress as we reach for the very stars themselves. It is our floating home and the cradle of mankind's technological evolution. You walk within the very future of the human race, and you are most, most. Hey, nummy numbers. Titch, uh, I think Titch did enjoy her holiday. She was very relaxed. She missed going outside, though. My mum was too scared to let her outside. In case she, like, tried to find her way home or something. Um, but she's been outside today, chasing butterflies. Okay, so that is a big... That is a big ship that Tesla has built there. Well, no, that's actually the model of the ship, but you know what, you know what I mean. Terrible Gamer says, what is that, a ship for ants? <laughs> nice reference. I got it, but I can't remember the name of the film. The one about Blue Steel. Tesla Tower. My first Tesla Tower at Warden Cliff was a huge success. I always knew that my dream of free energy transmitted wirelessly across the globe would be a resounding success. What I did not foresee. Another Wii Loot to help top up the spent yen. 
So this hockey rough on the Oh, thank you. Wireless transmission of power, that's the easy part. Finding that power in the first place, now there's the tricky bit. X-ray machine. When I discovered the X-ray, we would have wonderful times in the lab shooting each other with the team. Two. Blackened silhouettes on the walls, capturing a single moment of playtime for all eternity. That is, of course, until we realize <laughs> the X-rays are quite, quite... Zoolander, that's the one. This machine makes the whole process much safer, though far less fun. Excellent. I do remember this game having, like, a nice, like, a... Uh, it's a, it's a horror puzzle game, but there's also quite a nice bit of humour in there every so often. Amazing scheme of the great inventor to draw millions of volts of electricity through the air from Niagara Falls and then feed it out to cities, factories and private houses from the tops of towers without wires. Wireless technology? No way. Earthquake machine brings down city blocks. Seven killed and many injured as buildings come falling down. Misguided experiment creates damage at Wardenclip Warehouse Quarter. Oh, Tesla, you naughty boy. Has the coil. That's a real thing. Neon light. Oh yeah, that's a real thing. Pretty sure he didn't make an, an earthquake machine. Radio waves aren't just great for transmitting sound images and the energy across large distances, but with this radio controlled boat, they can also be used to transport people. If you're here on the Helios, then you've already enjoyed a voyage on one of these. They are unmanned vessels, controlled automatically via radio signals. Less risky in case of malfunction and subsequent drowning. Not that there was ever much risk. That is to say, you're safely here, aren't you? So, all's well. All's well. Kate Lily says, man, all these little character details about the real Tesla are... Indeed they are, indeed they are. Very detailed game. Um, I'm not sure how long this game is, but um, the presentation and the detail... This is the sort of game that... Like, before I was doing streaming and stuff, this is the sort of game I'd just, like, turn all the lights off completely, like, just have a, like, alone time, just completely get absorbed by the game and just, like, search every little corner and press every button. Um, <clears throat> just noticed your T-shirt. Did you record the top 40 from the radio in the 80s, says Mozzie? I did. Although this says, games were better in my day. Earthquake machine, there's the earthquake machine. He tried to make an earthquake machine, allegedly. According to Kate Lilly. Tesla. Uh, Tesla connoisseur. Kate Lilly. Wardenclyffe announced a success. Resonance with another dimension. Only Tesla knows how it works. Dawn of free energy. Is Tesla violating the law of conservation of energy? Free energy threatens thousands of energy jobs. Riots expected. I'd rather have free energy, to be fair. Okay, here we go. Creepy ship full of scientists in the middle of the ocean. What could possibly go wrong? Everything. Everything! Yeah, it looks like everything has gone wrong. Oh dear. Oh craps. Is that That's seagulls? Oh, there's big birds on that statue anyway. Uh, hello, rabbit. I'm uh, I'm good, thanks. A little bit. Well, I say a little bit. I'm quite quite jet lagged. What the fuck? What the? What the? <laughs> okay, I'm tripping balls now. Uh, Hello? Anyone? Nice mask. <laughs> What's going on? Tripping balls here. Whoa. OK. 
Okay. What the hell was that? Whoa, fuck. Ghosts. Rose? Are you there? Can you hear me? Yeah, I can hear you, but what the hell am I doing here? If you didn't write the letter, who did? It's in your handwriting and everything. This is gonna sound weird, but it might have been me. Not present me, but future me. I know how crazy that sounds, but I promise I can explain everything. Let's rendezvous in my apartment. From there, we'll escape together, okay? Escape from what, exactly? It's not safe here, Rose. It's spreading throughout the ship. I'll tell you everything when we meet up in my apartment. You need to grab a Faraday keycard from the check-in desk there in the main hall. They're kept in a wall-mounted safe. The combination should be written down somewhere nearby. The keycard will automatically take the elevator to the right district. Did you get all that? Yeah. Open safe, get keycard, use elevator, meet in your apartment. I, I got it. Great. I won't be able to reach you on the radio for a bit, so just get there and stay safe, okay? Fine. But when you get there, I'm expecting some answers. Deal? Deal. Oh, and sis, even if I can't explain why or how you got here, I really am grateful that you're here. See you soon. See you soon, sis. Who leaves a combination for a safe written close by to a safe? That just seems a little bit counterproductive. New collectible picked up. Uh, engraving on the inside reads, Ship Security Anonymity Mask. These masks are a little bit creepy. All the Dishonored loves is Gavin UK. Yeah, a, there is a big Dishonored vibe with these masks. Why can't I bloody climb over that? Mathematician Elmira Sanger, now part of the Warden Cliff Corporation. Never heard of her. What's that? That's a, a weird symbol. What is that doing on that table? Is there can't interact with it in any way. How bizarre. It's a pretty creepy symbol. Warden Cliff announces success. Resonance within another dimension. Read that one already. Is one of these a check-in desk? I think I can get around the side of this one. There's a, that looks like a safe. Why can't why couldn't I have done that to the other stuff I couldn't pass, huh? Alright, what have we got here? We've got a uh, current code, 142. New safe code. Okay. New safe code 142. That must be the safe. You reckon? Now to get it open. Oh. Oh, you like that, are you? Yeah, nice. Ooh, district key cards. Faraday elevator. Bingo. A key card for the elevator. Can I take all of the key cards? How about those notes? Seems like they'd all be important in some way, but I can't take any of them. Never mind. I got the Faraday elevator, though. <gasps> uh, what the fuck? Whoa! It's getting crazy. All right, what, what's going on? So we're in the main hall now. Guess it's up the up to left, huh? All right. Hope this works. Oh. Warning! Warning! Enjoy your yummy yummers, nummy nummers, says Gavin UK. Ah. Oh. Now we know this has got to go because dinner's ready. Ah, okay. Well, this stream will, uh, you know, you'll be able to watch this stream sometime in the future because they all get saved. So uh, do uh, 
do come back and uh, catch up with what you missed if you are enjoying the show so far. Nummy numbers. So this has references to real sci-fi science people and spooky stuff on top of that, says Rabbit. Yes, correct. Nikola Tesla did uh, lots of crazy sciencey stuff, and um, I think this is kind of like pretending that his more extravagant experiments worked out. Okay, the home of Hestia, chapter three. Let's keep going. Follow the uh, blood splats. Ugh. What is that smell? Sorry, I farted. <laughs> I didn't. Really, I didn't really fart. I mean, I have farted before, like in my life, but not just then. Oh, I'm gonna shut up. As is tradition aboard the Helios, we will hold the annual ball to welcome our new arrivals. Let's see. A board employee left a sketch of Tesla behind. Huh, it's a nice little sketch. I wonder if it was actually drawn by a board employee of this game. Like this is made by a very small Spanish studio, I think, called Storm in a Teacup or something like that. But it's just it's beautiful. Really, really is a good looking game. What is that? Is that a ghost? Another ghost. Oh fuck! That wasn't. Okay, boop 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 boop, reverse, reverse. Newly opened Warcliff Operation in South America reignites tensions. Edison threatens to resume legal actions. Hmm. Uh, let's go right. Locked. Left. Darn. Great. Let's go left. Rose, did you reach my apartment district yet? <clears throat> yeah. This door <laughs> won't open. Easy there, champ. Try putting your considerable weight behind it. Ah, it's an Italian team. There we go. Whoa! Fuck. What? Oh, oh my god! What's going on? They're in pieces, Ada. Shit. Get me out. How do I get out? Rose? Rose! It's gonna be okay. Rose, listen to me. You're having a panic attack. Just focus on my voice, Rose. Close your eyes and just focus on my voice. Breathe with me. One leaf Breathe in. with me. One thorn out. One leaf in. One thorn out. One leaf in. One thorn out. There you go. Oh dear. Good. Good. They've been butchered, Ada. Who or what did this? We don't we don't know yet. But right now we need to get you safe. Make your way to the center of the apartment complex. There's a generator that will open the gates. Focus on that for now. I'm on my way. I'll broadcast you again shortly. Be careful, sis. I'll try. Terrible gamer YL says uh this is all my favourite bits about what Bioshock, walking around, exploring Rapture, reading and listening to audio diaries without having to worry about splices every two seconds. And uh, I think she's allowed to have a panic attack given the circumstances, says an unholy Muppet. Yeah, indeed. Why is my... I think I need to sort out the, my mouse moving, because it's... It's because I've... It's because I put the sensitivity down quite low, I think. It seems to be a bit jerky when I move it. I don't know. Maybe it's just my hands. There is a great deal of entrails. Time is not a river. 
So the oh god, look at that. Something weird's going on with dimensions and time travelling, I think. Shit. That person is has literally been torn in half by something. Fuck. Time is not a river. How? how I mean, writing that in your own blood on the wall once is quite a mission, I'd expect, as you were dying. But to do it twice, that's just, that's just overkill. Okay, here we go. This is, uh... Well, this is where the ghost was and the person ran past. Looks like there's nothing here for me. This direction. So this is the living quarters, I think. Um, although, it's kind of like the dying quarters right now. <laughs> oh, fuck. Are, they, are those bullet holes? Who knows? Gore galore, says Isabel CW1. Indeed, so much gore. Faraday District. Nothing of import in there. Midnight. Lights out. No debates past midnight. Arguing over the limitations of Fourier transformations can wait. No need to bother the rest of the district. Keep your lively debates and discussions for the designated halls and hours. Continued disturbances will be reported to the Department of Security. Shit. Hey, you a fuck? No, no way that Peter Archer visited here. Okay, so I need to find what quarter Ada is in. Are by these looking at the names. From the past? Wait, what? Oh, there you go. Another, another ghosty thing. The one electron theory reaches four sigma certainty. Helios research result alters the foundation of physics. Mathematical advance is proved correct. This is a disaster, claims multiple universities. I don't know what that means. That was too sciencey for my tiny brain. Hello. Okay, what have we got here? Me. Let's see about getting some lights on in here. Okay. Step one, make sure the active line light is green. If needed, use the line control button to cycle the power lines. There, green, okay. Proceed to step two. Enter the correct access code, 11213. 11213. Green, yeah, cool. Step three. When the access code has been accepted, you may proceed to flip the switch. Nice. Alright, we've got some power on. So the lights are on. Can I get into this door now? No. Nope. So whoever was having a, a shadow wank at the window isn't going to get a, a, um, a visit from me yet. I'll take your brain to another dimension. Play close attention, says Hockey Rock. Oh, well, Uh-oh. Hello? Who is this? If you have harmed my sister, I swear to God I will break every phone. Oh, hey, hey. I haven't harmed anyone, all right? My name's Aubrey, and it's really, really nice to finally talk to someone who isn't decomposing, you know. Never mind, sorry. But you have got to get me out of here. I'm holed up in the engine halls, starboard side, deck 82. Kind of trapped, actually. How soon can you get here? Look, buddy, I can't make any promises. I'm going to get my sister off this thing, but if we can, we will come to get you too. How does that sound? Oh yeah, of course. Don't mind me. I'll just sit here and starve. No problem. That's no, it's great. You know, Benny here at the corner died due to an exotic energy leak, but he still has most of his spine intact. Maybe he can lend it to you so that the next time a person in need asks for help, you'll have a nice 
enough of a backbone to actually do something. Ah. Wow. So that must be exotic energy must be what the exo is referring to here, the severe exo leak. It must be severe exotic energy leak or something. So um yeah, we've got to watch out for some of that. Lovely little flowingtons. Okay, what else have we got here? Nothing, nothing, nothing. I mean look at that, that's gorgeous. If only I could do a smooth pan. Maybe it's because I maybe it's the game struggling more than anything. I've got the game on like ultra settings. Like a lambda. Nope. Oh shit. So many daddies. Hey pigeon. Also, there were pigeons, not seagulls or doves. Zeta. Nope. Oh, wait. Oh, yeah. cool. Not going through that anytime soon. Okay, so I need to turn the electricity off to get through that bit, I guess. And that cable's going up there. Let's have a walk, wander up here. What's this? Vita used to be great at it. What did I just get then? I just got a key card or something, but. Ah, here we go. What is it? W. Steinitz key. Forgotten key card to the W. Steinitz apartment. Okay. Keep on lookout for the W. For W. Steinitz. Oh, Gavin says this is on Unreal Engine 4, so it's very demanding on mech settings. I had to run it on medium and it still stuttered. Ah, I see, okay. So. I mean, it's actually running quite well, it's just, yeah, when I turn it does seem a little bit like a drops a frame or two. If it's annoying you lot, let me know and I'll um I'll turn the, the settings down a bit, but it's not not really bothering me that much at the moment. a big area to can I go this way? No. Big area to explore. Um what is this? Guest quarters. Oh hello. Fuck are you. Is it a ghost or is it some exo energy thing? Guest key cards. That is for the wind suite. And this is the fire guest suite. Okay. This, the obnoxiously curious 18 year old who visited last week, Albert, left his belongings in the wind guest suite. Could you get in touch with our German Wardencliffe office in order to arrange the return shipping of his things? Pierce we received a special request for a piano to be brought to the earth suite. Ooh. I hadn't even noticed there was uh, problems, it says Castaway DC. Sweet! Did you make it to the Ghibli Museum at all, says Fruit Bat on Loot? We didn't. Um, it gets booked up super quick. And um, uh, I couldn't get the day I wanted. I could have booked a day, but um, the only one available was when we weren't in the area, unfortunately. I'll just have to go next time. Hello. Hmm. Welcome aboard. Oof. Lovely balloons. Oh, shit, son. <laughs> she made me jump. Always, always, always believe in yourself, because if you don't, then who will, sweetie? OK. 
Okay, so someone's birthday suite. I don't think there's anything else in here, apart from a lot of balloons. <laughs> Lucy Lil found wind room quite funny. Glad I wasn't the only one that that made jump cast away. Just spamming these to see if any of the cards I picked up let me in. Oh, what's this? Three, three, two, one, two. Emergency generator. Three, three, two, one, two. I'll try and remember that. That sounds like something I need to remember. Three, three, two, one, two. Service? Yes, please. <laughs> One. Hello. Well, there's blood drips on the sofa then. Right, kind of Helios personnel. I realise this probably isn't very proper. However, after a very illuminating conversation with the lead researcher Archer, Archer, I must return to the mainland to pursue an idea. As fellow scientists, I'm sure you understand the desire to chase these rare moments of inspiration. If need be, chalk my hasty escape up to overly eager youth. Thank you for your hospitality during my brief yet productive stay. Danke, Albert. So Albert legged it off. He's left something behind, allegedly. Is it... Is it his passport? He's a bit screwed then, if it was. Albert Einstein! Haha, <laughs> nice. Very good, very good. It almost seems like there should be something else here. Okay, three, what was it? Three, three, two, one, two, was it? Three, three, two, one, two. Those are the keys. Hmm. Right, let's keep going. Because I think I can squeeze across here, can I? Nope! <sighs> Ow! Bloody hell, it's got Jason Brady from Fallout 3. Damage, full damage. Okay, so I, was, I went up there. Didn't have too much luck. Let's keep exploring. Midnight lights out. The Helios gym. Guy's been working out too hard. It's got very, a very curved leg. <laughs> That's true. You lot can be my memory, Kate Lily. That'll work. Fallout 3, Far Cry 3. Did I say Fallout 3? I meant Far Cry 3. Of course, my jet lag brain is. Uh, Struggling to cope. <laughs> uh, okay, so that's closed. Some stuff here. What's this? To whoever is repeatedly seeing the toilet baby deliveries, hope you die of rectal hemorrhaging. <laughs> A toilet paper thief. Cute. Alpha corner. So I can't... There's no way to get up these bits, is there? Locked. 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 Okay, where are we going to go there? 
Where are we going to go? So I look in here already? W. Stein's apartment. I've not been looking for W. Steinitz's apartment, to be honest. This is where I came down from, isn't it? Yeah. Nope, that's not... Looks a bit creepy. What's the dead people again? Let's head up here. See what we can see up here. It's a lot to explore in this uh, this level. I could jump over that, or I could go down here. Down here first. What have we got here? Mops and shit. Ooh. It's not fair. We in the biology department come back with clothes either covered in blood or dirt, while the worst the physics department ever gets is some light chalk stains from writing equations all day. We need at least two laundry days to get the blood stains out. Fix this! Okay. What the hell are they experimenting on? Did I already. Oh, look at you. Oh. There's a ladder there. It's a ladder and a note. So I think, did I, have I already searched this way? Oh no, this is the other side of where I was. Okay. Okay, okay. Okay, okay. So I'll jump over that barrier in a second. But I want to climb up the ladder and see what note I am very engrossed in this game, Fruit Bat. You're correct. I really like it. Oh dear. New collectible picked up. Aaron Prosper with wife Mary, uh, Marie and son Humphrey and Benjamin. Hey Dad, this is the photo you took before you went aboard. Looking forward to new stories on your return. Mom says hello. Humphrey. Oh. Dad. Dad dead. Dead dad. Oops. Didn't have a key on him or anything though. Which is what I was hoping. The rail station doors are locked. Okay, so that's locked as well. Service. So the only way I can think of going before I'm stuck is jumping over this thing here. Wait, where was it? It was about this way. Wait, was it? Oh no. Yeah, it was back this way. Oh god. Oh, I'm so tired. <laughs> I'm actually not as bad this side. I'm like, I'm sleepy now. I'm feeling a bit jet lagged and weirded out. But going to Japan, like, I was so jet lagged. It took me ages to like accumulate or accustom myself even to the uh, to Japanese time zone. It was brutal. Archer oh. Ada. Aha. Hey. Out of now I just need to find a way inside. Ah, shit. Really? Find a key card to enter the Alpha Quarter. Oh, you bastard. Do I not have one? Okay. God. Yeah, some guy named Aubrey was broadcasting on our frequency. Said he was stuck in the engine halls and mentioned something about exotic energy. I'd like some answers. Rose, I'd rather explain it in person. 
It's no not way. now is a great time to tell me what the hell is going on here. Fine, fine. I'll be brief. Listen, we discovered quantum resonance anomalies that prove the one electron theory, meaning that every electron in the universe is the same one moving back and forth through time. So naturally, we began to consider a second time dimension attached to the Euclidean analogy of Minkowski space. Now, I know what you're thinking. Ada. What about the Thompson conjecture? Ada. Well, Ada, that's... Ada, 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 stop. It's me you're talking to. None of that nerd talk. Right. Uh, okay. A large experiment went boom. It ruptured a current of time and dangerous things have flooded through it. These things have been killing us. All of us. We've tried to contain it all, but... The point is, we need to leave. Did you find my apartment? Yeah, but the Alpha Quarter is locked. I can't get in. Don't suppose you keep a spare key card. <laughs> Don't. Shit. That's the toilet paper. Um, can I open this door now? Is that ah? So that's the thing. So I, I was like, oh, why can't I open this door? But it just, I, c I had to wait till a specific point. Uh, Hockey Rops getting part two of his MMR done tomorrow. Partially prodded into action by P32. Protect the herd, folks. That's measles, mumps, and rubella injection uh, inoculation. Good work, sir. Good work. I hope you don't feel too grim, Bob, doing it. Right, what is it? Oh, shit. Is it three, three, two, one, two? Yes, nice. Okay, power is off. Good, we're good to go. Nice. Down to the Gamma Quadrant. <laughs> Benjamin Blower uh, wrote the code was 80085, which looks like boobs. T -he. Classic gag. Classic gag. Excellent work. Right, can we get through here? We can squeeze through. Oh. Squeezy does it. A and T. Shit, that guy's been impaled by a table leg. What a way to go. What a way to go. There is a lot of dead people on this ship. Oh. Slimy. Oh. Exo ghosts. Key card to A King's apartment. That's not the key card I'm looking for, though, is it? There's nothing special there. Rats? Rats! Shit! Shitty rats. The circle must be broken. Right, row. But I like circles! Bad. No pupils. That's creepy. Okay, where are we now? Ah, oh, okay. This is. I got the keycard for W. Steinitz's room. Yeah, get immunized, people. Non, what is it? Anti vaxxers are crazy and they're putting everyone, including their own children and other people's children, in terrible danger. Um, just the stats of how many 
easily preventable diseases are making a recurrence is just, just frightening the idiocy of the human race. Sorry. <laughs> Sorry. Sometimes I despair. We're at a point where we have the most knowledge and the most potential to do good. And all we do is stupid shit. Sorry. <laughs> uh, what am I trying to do? Not neg everyone out. That'd be a good idea. Um, let's fuck away in here. You're not going to think nice hidden for me. Oh, fuck you then. Mm -mm. Uh, B. Elmadi. Bellamidi. Do, 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 do. M. Nielsen, do I have? No. A. Patel? No. Oh. What's this? Key card to Elisa Fairfield's apartment. And left outside her door deliberately. Is this A. King's apartment? Yeah, I kind of want to look in A. King's apartment first because I just found that key card lying around. Aubrey King. Can't be that many Aubreys on board. Is there? Wait, is Aubrey the one that has. New Warden Cliff weather breakthrough. Rain to provide Helios with electricity. Lead researcher Aubrey King innovates with a new solution. Was it Aubrey that was shouting at us? Where have you gone, Aubrey? What the fuck? That's weird. This letter is to inform you that effective May 2nd you are being demoted from lead researcher of the weather tech department to coordinator of the maintenance division. Not having reached sufficient results in the exploitation of the resources granted by Woodencliff, the company believes your long standing knowledge of the Helios would be better ensuring the functioning of these areas designated for the conversion of new energy sources. Wow. Unlucky, Aubrey. Shame, shame, know your name. Right, well. You don't really have anything good for me, Aubrey, so let's carry on. Wait, who's this room? P. Ivanov. Pivanov. See you later, Castaway! Thanks for coming along. We know what you did. Do what we say, as we say, when we say, or we will make sure your days of all the Helios are over. We'll be in touch. Oh dear. What's she been up to? Winning trophies. Winning shuffleboard trophies. She looks like she's loving some shuffleboard. Okay. What's this? Oh, I've read that. <laughs> I'm sleepy. Right, what have we got here? Ah. This is home. The Helios is the only place where I ever truly belong. The ship accepted me for being me. I cannot put into words what it's like to suffer through life without finding acceptance or kinship. But here aboard the Helios, not only did I find kinship, I found friendship, I found family. Now I've destroyed the only family I've ever known. I'm alone again. I was never meant to end up here, yet here I am, rope in hand with judgment at my door. I thought the barricade could hold them off, at least for a time. So naive of me, their clouds came through unhindered. Followed by the screams of my friends, I'm the only one left alone again. I wasn't supposed to happen like this. I was just supposed to. It was just supposed to delay the test. Just delay. That was all. A delay in exchange for their silence, so that I could remain on board with my friends. Not that it matters in the end. My guilt won't go away, and so the solution won't change. If you can forgive me, I thank you with all my heart. If you can't, I understand and accept your verdict. I'm alone again. It's all my fault. What have you done, Eliza? What have you? Ah, shit. God damn it, Eliza. 
So she's been there for a while. Uh, examine. Ada's second set of key cards to her apartment and quarter, given to her by a friend Eliza. Given to her friend Eliza. Key cards are worn after heavy use. Ada's key cards. Okay. Let's go. Let's go get my sister. This section of the ship is uh, pretty fucked up. The alpha Press F to play shuffleboard with you. I don't even know how to play shuffleboard, so you'll win. You'll win. The fuck? How did I? Oh, there we go. Follow this pipey thing, isn't it? Oi, 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 fuck off. Have you gone, creepy? Creepy McDouche. Alright, Ada's was up that way. Oh, fuck. Oh. Okay. Getting quite regular, these weird, weird visions now. Come and a rescue Ada. Is she even in her apartment or did she need me to get somewhere from her apartment? I can't remember now. I've got the key, so whatevs. Whatevs, Trevs. Ada Archer. Please work. Let me in. Yes! Whoop whoop. It's Rescue Higton. Hey, hey. Who the fuck are you? Whoa! Shit! Fuck! Who's that guy? What the hell is wrong with the people here? Ada owes me so many answers. Damn straight. Thomas Miller with wife Agnes and daughter Elizabeth. Please hurry back, we'll miss you so. Papa! Please, Papa! Please hurry back, Papa! Please! We will miss you so, Papa! Who will take us to the shop on the penny farthing to buy... Sacks of potatoes and penny sweets, Papa. Who will take us to the stores and carry the coal bags back to keep us warm in the fires, Papa? While you are gone, Papa, no one will be able to, Papa. Mm, Ada's room. Ada's room. Please, Papa, tell me where Ada's room is, Papa. And... We waited as long as we could for you, but it's not safe anymore. We've locked everything and moved out. I'm moving out with some people from Sigma and Delta. Meet us in the garden as soon as you can. Don't wait. Just go. Okay. Ada. Oh, Ada gets the penthouse suite. Jacko, some of us actually prefer sleeping during the night. I'm not saying you should stop sneaking your lady friend into your apartment, but for the love of things holy, please sound free for your room. Nice. Bit of, an, bit of an Italian stallion there. It's so nice to have Ian back. Insane, insane Ian, says Isabel CW1. Wait, what? Eating sugar? No, Papa. It's his fruit bat. I know insane. What? Open my door! Maybe a little bit. Maybe a little bit. <laughs> yeah, this is Ada's room, all right. This is a lot like The Observer, says Unholy Muppet. I also loved The Observer, which is why I think I like this game. Hmm. A ball. Hey, it's another one of these symbols. Can't do anything to them. What do they mean? WTH do they mean? Hey, that's got a water symbol on it. Taming a new kind of fire to raise mankind beyond its material limitations. Oh, you always did dream big, Ada. Yeah. So Ada's pretty sciencey. But she's also not in here by the looks of things. 
triangle. Well, that triangle's got like wind. Those are going to be symbols for a puzzle, right? Almost definitely. Hey, da. There's another one. It's a diamond. That's got. What's that going to be? I don't even know what that is. Hey, look. Oh, I haven't uh, seen this picture in years. We were just kids. Oh. Hey, Rose. Whoop. Where are you? I made it to your apartment, and if we were to make it off the ship alive, I need to understand what's going on. For example, you said a future you wrote me the letter that brought me here. What does that even mean? My research is about exploiting loopholes in the flow of time. So a future me will write that letter and somehow send it back in time to get you here on the... Helios. Holy shit! And I think I know how! Listen, Rose, I need you to grab me some very important research. There's a secret room in my room. You find it while I make my way through another laboratory department. I'll give you a clue. It's center stage. That's it. You're just going to leave me to figure this out on my own? Have fun. Seems... Seems a little bit shitty. Why didn't you, why didn't you just tell me? It's center stage. Cracks on cracks by that picture. I don't know if that means anything. It's center stage. She said there's a secret in her room. What even is center stage? Look at that. Hmm. Ah, center of the room. Is that? Is that like a? Is that showing a painting? Yeah. There we go. Ah, oh, so now I can move this. All right, sweet. Now what? Triangle wind, right? Okay. Uh, many-sided thing is water. Diamond. What was diamond? Diamond was like CB. It's like a CB shape, I think. There it is. Like a CB thing. Okay. Okay, I'm using I'm using my brain here. Sorry, it hurts, but I, I'm, I'm doing it. So that's oh, that one. And the final one is that shape, which is over here, and that is um flame. A flame. Oh, le flambe. Boom! Brainy! Me is me. Brain is me. <laughs> oh, it's meant to be Earth. Says Angel B. I knew that. Ooh. Oh, okay. Oh, hello. Oh, fuck. No one's been down here for a while. Okay. Curious. Come aboard the Helios. We'll get together. Have a few laughs. <laughs> <laughs> no, 
nice of Tesla to have built secret passages in his rooms on his boat. I guess her sister rigged up the secret passage and just led to some kind of weird engineering room with no other entrance. Hmm. Okay, what have we got here? So this is it? This is the research that will allow the letter to go back in time? Hmm. I thought it would be thicker. Mm, good point. Hey, how's it going? <laughs> Pretty good, although I'm afraid I found an error in your fancy calculations. <laughs> that would be the day. What did you find? Well, you've got massless known vectors intersecting with relativistic spoon dimensions. None of what you just said makes any sense whatsoever. Makes just as much sense to me as this notebook. These equations will allow you to send the letter back in time? Yes, and since you received it, I've technically already done it. Or will do it, depending on how you look at it. Comforting to know that I'll at least live long enough to write it. But the research means so much more. It could do so much more for all of us. Promise me you'll protect it. Promise me. Fine, I promise. But now what? I've divided the research into two pieces. You only have half of it. I'm on my way to pick up the other half. I'm just gonna go through the bio labs now and we'll... What the... Damn it! Rose, I'm trapped! Rose, I'm trapped in the bio labs! Shit, sir. Oh. Oh, to the bio labs. Um, Benjamin Blover had an excellent point. It made me laugh while I was uh, listening to that cutscene. It says, imagine how much work it must have been to move all that furniture into that room via a tiny air duct. Yeah, I mean, that's a lot of cushions and books. It would be doable. You just have to go backwards and forwards a shitload. made like a bunch of sofas like how many people does she tell about and invite to her secret room huh I want to make a secret room in my house boop, boop, ba, boop, boom. so here we go oh I'm sat in this chair for ages doing my back in Is something going to go past the front? Who knows? Not I. Not I. Oh, that floor's nice. Very shiny. Okay. So off to the bio lab. So, ah! Hello? Ah, our late arrival. A pleasure oh, to finally speak to you, my dear. Allow me to introduce myself. I am Nikola Tesla. I know who you are. Now go away so I can speak to my sister. I am afraid that won't be possible. As I'm sure you are aware, the Helios is under strict quarantine. And for that quarantine to be effective, I cannot have you and lead researcher Archer be opening containment doors all over this ship. Damage already caused is severe. I cannot allow you to make it worse. Therefore, the both of you must remain at your current locations until this situation is resolved. You are locking us up? We will be sitting ducks for whatever is out there. Rest assured that I am doing everything that I can to remedy this situation. Right. How is that working out, huh? A ship full of dead scientists. The great Helios falling apart at the seams. Where's your unlimited energy now?
Not the kind of help I was hoping for. So you can get me out? Well, that depends. Where are you? The Alpha Quarter of the Faraday District. Some kind of lockdown gate came down. Can you open it? <coughs> About that, can I count on you to come and help me out if I do this? My situation is uh, slightly more complicated. Aubrey, the door. Please. Pretty please. Go get your sister. I understand. Family first and all that. What a dish. Well, I've got family too, you know. And I'm still trapped. Help me, and I'll help you. Okay, Aubrey. Deal. Help me get to my sister, and we will come to get you too. I promise. Scout's on. Excellent. So I need you to stand away from the locked up gate while I work my magic. Let me know when you found some reason to cover, okay? Sure. Hang on. All right, here we go. Holy shit, Aubrey! The gate nearly exploded. Sorry, so sorry. My bad. I might have said a bit too much juice down the power lines. I'll be back in a minute. Just go to run some diagnostics and high five Benny. I think his arms should still be around here somewhere. Sounds good. Oh. Well, nice work, Aubrey. Talk to you soon. Yeah, cheers, Aubrey. Nah. -uh. Boobs. That's me shouting boobs down the tube. It's a boob tube. What? It will be oh my god. Red blood from time blood. Holy shit. Oh my god. So it's him that's writing that stuff, not people Time as they're dying. Okay. Time is not a river. Avoid the knife for your immunity. I don't think I'm going to be able to avoid him if I read this right. Uh, Who goes there? Stop! Oh, fuck you, Ludwig. Oh, shit. Wow. I didn't even know he was, uh, I was supposed to avoid him then. Oh, fuck. How am I supposed to avoid this dickhead? <laughs> Wowzies. That guy's got a point. I guess I'll just run this way then. Oh, it's terrible at running. Oh shit. 
Oh, I'm getting, I'm getting out of breath now as well. There's another one of those symbols. Okay. Jump into the last rail car at the far end of the train station. Oh, come on. Yikes. Rose? How does he know my name? Hey Dougie, thanks sir. I'm back. My leaf one thorn. All right. Well, this seems like a good place to end it. It's nearly been two hours. It's been about one hour. 50. Hey, and you did that in about nine less attempts than me, Cisco in UK. Oh, that's good. Um, yeah, we're in a, we're, this looks like we're starting a new level, so I'm going to leave it there. I've done an hour and 50, my first stream back after three weeks away with quite a bit of jet lag, so uh, I think I've done alright. I think I've done alright. I'll hey, be back. Hopefully, this will save. Uh, I'll be back streaming tomorrow. Um, I'll either do this or a VR game. I might continue with this, to be honest. I quite, I'm quite enjoying this. Hey, Drazan! Drazzy Drazan! Um, yeah. Uh, I'll probably continue with this tomorrow unless I see a good VR game I want to play. Um, and then, uh, yeah, Friday will be Drunk PUBG! which will be nice. So, yeah, I'm looking forward to seeing what else happens in this game, though. But, um, yeah, thank you very much, all 133 of you, for coming back and welcoming me back. Nice, a lovely warm welcome from you all. So uh, thank you very much for uh, not disappearing and deciding never to come back after I was uh, mysteriously away for three weeks. Uh, it's been, uh, yeah, it's been a pleasure streaming this. Hopefully I'll be a little bit more awake for you all tomorrow. Um, but uh, either way, have a good night or day, wherever you are, and uh, don't have nightmares. <laughs> uh, people are liking, uh, looks like Dougie and Saul have gone to see the new John Wick movie and they've liked it. I'm going on Saturday, not to see John Wick, to see Pokemon, Detective Pikachu, whatever it is, because uh, that looks like quite a cool film. Uh, bye! Bye! <laughs>